Israel's relentless attack on Gaza continues. Since the start of the war, the Israeli military has dropped 6,000 munitions every 30 seconds. The death toll in the Strip has climbed to more than 1,900. Meanwhile, there has been growing speculation that both sides have committed war crimes. Amid this, a rights group has accused the Israeli forces of using white phosphorus. Human Rights Watch, HRW, has also accused Israel of using white phosphorus munitions in its military operations in Gaza and Lebanon, stating that the use of such weapons puts civilians at risk of serious and long-term injury. So what is white phosphorus? White phosphorus is a toxic chemical which burns at more than 800 degrees Celsius, which is high enough to melt metal. It is used as a weapon in conflict and is deployed in the form of bombs, grenades, rockets or artillery shells. White phosphorus munitions are made from combining a mixture of white phosphorus and rubber. Since the chemical ignites instantly in contact with oxygen, its function as a weapon is to burn fast and bright. It is used by militaries around the world, including Israel and the United States, to eliminate targets as part of tracer munitions at night. It is also used to create smoke screens during the day, as they release a huge amount of smoke when burned. So how dangerous are white phosphorus munitions? White phosphorus burns human skin and disintegrates tissues inside the body. It ignites when exposed to oxygen and continues to burn until it is deprived of oxygen or it is exhausted. The toxic chemicals are absorbed by the body and cause multiple organs like the heart, liver and kidneys to dysfunction. According to experts, white phosphorus sticks to many surfaces including skin and clothing, and is difficult to wash off. Inhaling the fumes can be lethal, leading to severe irritation to the eyes and making them sensitive to light. Exposure of the chemical can also result in facial paralysis and seizures.